You're watching Round Roanoke, your source for what's happening in the Valley. I'm your host, Margaret Hunter Wade. Founded in 1965, Total Action for Progress, or TAP, serves over 5,000 individuals annually, helping them achieve economic and personal independence through education, employment, affordable housing, and safe and healthy environments. This month, TAP celebrates its 50th anniversary with dinner, dancing, and a tribute to Cabell Brand, the organization's founder. Here to tell us more is the president and CEO, Annette Lewis. Thanks for being here. Well, thanks for having me. It's good to see you. Goodness, is there anything you all haven't done? <laughs> I, you know, gave a list of things that you that are focus areas for you. But who is TAP when you tell somebody on the street who you are? Well, uh, you know, we're excited. Uh, Fifty years of being in this region. Uh, we serve 11 jurisdictions uh, with more than 30 programs. Um, founded in 1965 by Cabell Brand, who sadly passed away after 91 years of age earlier this year. Uh, we started when President Lyndon Johnson signed into law in 1964 the Economic Opportunity Act. He declared a war on poverty, okay. and so TAP joined that in, in, in that war. And we, too, want to create a great society, as he did. And so TAP has done a number of things to help bring about a great society, particularly for the disenfranchised. Mm -hmm. um, we believe that no child should go hungry, so we started the food bank, which is now Feeding America. We believe that every child should have an education um, and should be able to go on to post-secondary education if they can. Uh, so we started the first desegregated school with Head Start in the region. Um, and we also help first-generation college students to go on to post-secondary education all across the state uh, with an agency we started, Project Dis Discovery. Uh, we believe that everybody should live in safe and affordable housing. We have a general contract on staff. We build houses. Uh, we transform communities. Uh, we weatherize homes. Uh, we believe that uh, people should be able to put their hands uh, to work for themselves. So we have skilled training. Uh, we also uh, believe that nobody should be abused or assaulted. So for 40 years we've had a domestic violence services program and we opened Sabrina's Place in 2007 for supervised visits for victims of domestic violence. And we certainly believe, there's so many things we do, but we certainly believe that no veteran should be homeless. So we rapidly rehouse veterans and we help them find jobs and we help them if they are on the verge of being homeless to uh, uh, prevent homelessness for them. But we have over 30 programs uh, and we do so many things. Well, you all do do a lot and I'm sure we could spend five minutes talking <laughs> about all that great stuff. Mm -hmm. But to celebrate all of this and to bring awareness to who you all are, it, you do have an event coming up wrapping a 50th anniversary yes. and honoring your founder, Cabell Brand, as I mentioned. So tell us what this party is going to be all about. It sounds like fun. Well, it's going to be exciting. On October the 23rd at 6 p.m. at Hotel Roanoke and Conference Center, we want all of our friends and supporters to join us in this great celebration. Uh, we're going to have Leanne Tui. Leanne is the mother featured in The Blind Side. Sandra Bullock played her oh, wow. in, in The Blind Side <laughs> movie. So we are so excited. She's an author, a philanthropist. So she will be there. Um, we're going to have music and dancing, uh, music by the William Penn Quartet. Mm -hmm. And I'm sure a lot of people in the community know William mm -hmm. Penn and yeah. his talent. Um, we are also going to honor the memory of Cabell Brand. He was such a giant. Uh, he cared about people, uh, and he did so much for education, for the environment, for health care. Uh, we're going to honor the first, uh, with the first Cabell Brand Hope Award. Oh, that's excellent. Yes. Do we know the recipient? We do. Thanks to our board. Drum roll. Yes, <laughs> and thanks to our board and the people in the community who heard about us doing that and the nominations, our board has decided that Pearl Fu will be our first recipient. Wonderful. I can't think of anybody more deserving. That's excellent. So that will be at the event. And that was 
she was um, selected for this how? We uh, actually had a period of nominations. We opened up nominations, I believe around uh, yeah, definitely in August. Mm -hmm. People had at least 30 days yep. to uh, submit their nominations and I think we had at least six nominees. Very, very well worthy people. Um, Pearl Fu one out, mm -hmm. I think is very p befitting because she is the founder of Local Colors. She helped us to realize that we can work together, play together, worship together, regardless of our backgrounds. Perfect and fit. certainly Cabell brand. Absolutely. Would say well, that's that excellent. And you all have a lot going on. Folks can get more information on your website? Yes, www dot tap into hope dot org right. or they could call five four zero two eight three four eight six six and Carrie Garnett will be glad to answer any questions. Thank you, Annette. Good luck with the event. Thank you. Thanks so much. You can find out more about TAP and the upcoming celebration on the community calendar coming up at the break. I'm Margaret Hunter Wade and you're watching Round Roanoke on Cox Nine. Thanks for tuning in.